Okay, on the uh, on the bench today. Okay, on the bench today. I think we have here uh, some golden tees, like the arcade board. So I think we got two in here. I think we got a green board and a red board. Um, he said it would only get to a certain part and then lock up, freeze, whatever. So uh, one does have a video card and one doesn't have a video card, um, as far as a, the uh, complaint. Uh, let's open this up and let's just see what we're dealing with here. And I'll have to bust out a power supply here too as well. Okay. So we got it open. Now that looks well packed, doesn't it? So these are going to be the hard drive right off the bat. Oh yeah. Oh, and packing peanuts like a motherfucker too. Okay, so let's get those out of the way. Um, I'm not going to have any room with this big ass box on my desk here. On the bench, sorry. Um, I'm actually going to be expanding the bench, believe it or not. Um, got a new piece coming in, going all across here to expand and give myself some more room and all that other stuff here. Give me a second here and let me, uh, let me get this out. It's just the two boards, eh? Man, he packed these. These are packed amazing. Look at this. You can put like cardboard in like that's that's beautiful shit i wish more people would pack stuff like that okay give me two seconds here and i'll pull both these out and put them on the bench and get rid of this box and everything and we'll go from there okay so uh this is what we're working with here so we got two drives one two um we got looks like a compact flash as well and we've got the uh eagle 2.9 or 2.09, sorry, uh, ROM for, uh, I think I had one up here too as well, just in case that one's no good, but we can always check that, see if that's all right or not. Uh, let's do, uh, sorry, I'm, what I'm going to do is I'm going to look at the complaint and see which one he actually cares about first and foremost, right? And then we'll do that one and then we'll move to the other one. I think the green board is the one he didn't care and the red one was the one he cared about. So uh, give me two seconds here and we'll unwrap this. Okay, so under the bubble wrap was actually the cardboard and the saran wrap. That's one thing I suggest. Don't use saran wrap. That stuff is so full of static. Don't use saran wrap. I'm sure this is okay, right? But just in case, if you've got something that's really, really, really sensitive, do not use saran wrap. That's a no-no. Don't do that. Okay, we got it out here. And he's already got it installed here. And, uh, yeah, that's in the right way. Uh, we may have to check that, too. I don't know if that looks swollen or what. Not that that should be an issue or anything, but uh, so we do need a power supply on this one here. Um, everything looks okay. We're just going to do a quick visual inspection here. Maybe get you in a little bit. Maybe turn on the light. Uh, definitely look for all, you know, the normal stuff with these kind of boards. The corrosion, you know, especially around this area here. Especially around this area here. Here. Any line in between here. And uh, to be honest, uh, yeah, this looks okay. Actually, I don't really see anything wrong with what's going on here. Um, yeah, so this is a Canadian one. Okay. Um, let's get real. Let's get really close in here. Let's take a good look here. I mean,. There's always shit on this, but that does not look bad. That, you know, that might be a no connect, but I do see a little bit of corrosion there. We can get that cleaned up. No, that one too, next to it. That looks all right. Yeah, we'll get this cleaned up and then we can take a really, really good look. But first, I'm going to grab a power supply. Uh... I think he had it disconnected like this for a reason. I think he was testing straight out from the video card, I think. Not really sure what he was doing there. Hmm. But yeah, I mean, you can do that. That's, that's fine. There's nothing wrong with that. Um, so yeah, I'll get... Uh, huh. I guess we can... I guess we could do... 
a compact flash and the drives and just make sure that they're all okay. Uh, first, we, we are definitely going to have to get this hooked up though and just see what happens. So let me get the power supply and uh, actually I have a up and running um, hard drive already. So we may just use that and leave these alone for a second. Yeah, let me figure this out. Okay, you'll have to excuse the crude video that's running through this and I figure we might as well just put it back the way it should like normal how it should be inside a cabinet okay so that right there to me I may have to grab the other that looks so fucking blurry but uh, I believe that's gonna reset on me yep I believe this is what's bad right now I I think that's the working one and this is one of the bullshit ones but this this is what he was saying it was doing. But I think this is one of the I think this is my bad one. So give me two seconds here and let me get this straightened out. Yeah, exactly. That one wasn't written on. This one was written on by me. So this is a good working drive. Okay, that uh, that was real quick. <laughs> that was real real quick. I just hope it's not one of these things where he's got an issue on his end and this was sent to me and I see IDE activity. I see. Voltage. Okay. I can't tell for use in Canada. Voltage level. Okay. System status. Okay. I don't know if he was saying it was getting to here and re resetting. <laughs> of course it works, right? Of course it does. I had a feeling. So does he have a bad hard drive or a bad compact flash? Which is fine. I mean, if it is, we'll just write him a new a new image, right? Like that's no big deal. But is that the case or is he having an issue on his end? Because even with this power supply, I don't have any control over voltage. I let this handle everything. Did that lock up? Yes, no, maybe so. No IDE activity. Maybe we are getting to a problem here or that probably that fan from that hard uh power supply is gonna drive you nuts here in about two seconds. Let me get you up here. See if I can oh, that's a reset. Yep, that's a reset. Okay. Maybe that was happening. Okay, good. So we do have a problem here. Well, not good, but let's see what happens here. Let's just let this run through again and see what happens. We're getting a reset for some reason. Let's see what the hell happens here. Let's, let's go through this one more time, see what happens. fine now or is it gonna lock up mm, I think we've locked up already because I can't see any hard drive activity and we should we absolutely should I'm gonna go ahead I'm gonna go out on a limb here and say that the board is okay but we have something real funky happening here it almost looks like I mean if I wasn't talking it almost looks like the whole video froze um yeah it's gonna reset here it comes yep oh yeah we okay so we do have an issue okay let me um let me get the compact flash right let me see what happens with the compact flash let's shut this down here god these things are so rough on the drives i'm just gonna put you down just like that for a second let me open up this compact flash um, mm, mm, mm. Oh, yeah, he's got that taped up too. A little while. Oh, jeez. Okay, give me a second here. This is really wrapped up. 
Okay, we got a compact flash here. So this is Golden T4 Extra. So let's go ahead and let's remove the power from this one. Again, I don't even know if this hard drive is perfectly operational, so it could be that as well. But it does seem like the board's okay. I mean, it 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 went through all, everything it's supposed to. So let me get that off to the side. Let's turn this around here, just so you can see exactly what I'm doing here. Let's get the compact flash in. This is one, right? No, actually, this is one. But it doesn't matter. It, it really shouldn't matter. It shouldn't. Let's get that in. Let's make sure that compact flash is in there properly. Seems like it. Let's get you up here. Get you down here. Let's get some power. I hate these things. These things are so cheap. The pins never line up properly. That one actually went in really well. Okay, let's see what happens here now. I see activity. Check complete. Get that out of the way. Golden T4, 5.0000. I think the other one's 5.0010 or something like that. The one on the hard drive. Let's see what happens here. If we're going to get a stop in the same area, I mean, that's going to be odd to me. It's your game. Let's see what happens here. Okay, we still have hard drive activity. Yes, we... Oh, yes, we... Oh. We did. Come on. Come on. Oh, yeah, there we go. Okay, so I bet you that other drive... I bet you the drive's failing on the other one, which is... Come on! Oh, is this... Is this fucking stupid thing screwing up here? Oh, we have hard drive activity, but everything's fa everything stopped here for a second here. God, that video card's hot already. We're, we're good here, but we got... Video is fucking up here. We are good here. Uh, what in the hell is going on here? I can almost guarantee it's got something to do with this bullshit here. So we might have to check the other one out as well. Go back to that. Uh, it's probably... Oh, I don't know why it would play the video fine, but then... Lock up. What, are we okay here? Welcome to Gold Oh, yeah. Hi, I'm Pat Summerall, and with me is... And I do have a trackball, but... Peter? Thanks, Pat. I'm all set for a great round. Yeah, no, that's that's running. It's just we got something goofy going on here. That's all. Yeah, we are definitely running here. It's your game. You know what? You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to I'm going to bypass I'm going to bypass this real quick here. Are we going to loop back up? That's what we're looking for. We're looking for some hard drive activity here. Yep. See? I mean, we're fine. Yep, hang on here, hang on here, hang on here. I can almost guarantee you it's that GBS 8200 acting up. I can almost guarantee it. Uh, let me shut that down before I fucking do that. We'll restart it. Let me get rid of that. Let me pull that out. Let me get this in here. This uh, video card doesn't seem to be locked down, by the way. There's no, what do you call it? There's no screws locking it down. I do have a I do have a set that will work in it though to keep that video card from flopping around like that. I do see a little bit of corrosion on the pins here, which is normal, but yeah. So let's try this. Let's go right from the video card. Let's see what happens here. You'll notice that it'll look different too. Oh, shut up, you! Really? Give me a second. Okay, it was running fine, right? I don't know what was going on with this. I hate when that does that. But anyways, it did just reset. Even with the compact flash. So, you know what? Oh, look it, look it, look it, look it, look it, look it, look it. 
We got a video card here. I bet you that's what's fucking causing a reset. Give me two seconds here. Let me shut this down. Yep, I can almost guarantee we got a bad video card happening here. Oh, yeah. Okay. I can almost guarantee that's what's happening here. We got a... We got a video card failing. And like I said, it's not locked in place at all. I mean, the card itself... It looks okay. This regulator's taking a beating, obviously, but... Yeah, that is brutally hot already. Brutally hot. Because all these run so fucking hot, right? Um, not gonna lie. The... The caps sometimes can be a problem on these, but, uh... No, these are... These are good. I don't see any issue here. Whatsoever. I'm gonna let this chill out for a second. And I do have a couple other video cards that we can try. I know that's in your way, but um, I'm going to let this cool down for a second. Yeah, I think maybe we've got a, I think maybe we've got a video card issue here. Yeah, let me let this cool down and I will pull another video card and uh, we can try that as well. Okay, so I let that cool down for a second here. And then I clean the uh, the edge connector of the video card. I just want to see if it makes a difference here. We're going to get a reset again, aren't we? Yeah, we are. Yeah, I can almost guarantee we're going to get a reset here. Yep, here it comes. Okay, what in the hell is going on here? Fuck, he is dead. Yeah, so he's definitely having an issue here. Well, I'm going to go over on a limb and say that it's not... It's not as compact flash. It's probably not as drives either. If those are working, they're probably working. So maybe we do have an issue with the board here. Well, let's go. Uh, we're gonna have to get into it here. Let's uh, let's get all this cleaned up here, right? Let's get all this cleaned up here on the edge of this here and the edge of this here. Let's see if we don't have an issue where it's causing a reset, because that could very well be it. So, uh, we'll just let this run through one more time. And again, it, it'll probably fail. Let me hit start. I just want to see if we can get it to go past that again or not. I'm just looking for that little red light in there. Just to see if that actually... Yeah, we're going to get a reset here. Oh, that's fucking stone cold. That's a little warm, but that's like normal. Everything's normal here. Everything seems normal here. Yeah, we're going to get a reset here. Here it comes. Yeah, okay. Let me go through and let's start uh, let's start cleaning this and checking this out. We could have an issue here. Okay, so apparently he got these boards. Uh, they came with two machines that were obviously in barns, right? That's they always are, right? But I am almost positive. Yes, I did. I, I cleaned them both. You know, I cleaned around both chips, and they were dirty, right? Like there is shit on it. Like it's actually worse in person, but this looks odd to me. Can you see how you can see through to the red? You can see down to the bare copper. Maybe I could turn that light off, maybe. Focus. No, you don't want to focus. Can you see that? That leads me to believe that somebody's been on this already. Because it's not just there. I mean, some of these are bad. Like, that ground pin is bad, for sure. So maybe we just, we just have a combination of things happen here. It's got to be something. It's definitely got to be something around here. But it does look... I mean, if you look at the way these look, right? That's the way they should look. Right? I don't believe that 
it came out looking like that out of the factory. There is just no, there's no way. And that's not reflection or anything. That is literally, that's been touched on for sure. Absolutely. And you can see corrosion in between, you know, some of the pins. You can actually see the corrosion in between the pins. I can almost guarantee that we do have something going on here like that. almost guarantee it i mean look how look at the edge of that those pins that has definitely been touched on there's no way that hasn't been touched there's no way there is no way i've never seen a board that looks like that that hasn't been touched there's no way so we're gonna have to break out the soldering iron here and uh get in here and start cleaning up some of these bad spots here for sure okay so i had to get a little rough on this side because it was worse than i thought it was uh let's get in here and look now that looks much better don't worry about the flux there let's just just need some more cleaning but that looks good i think that pin right there could use a little more a little more help, but maybe not. It's it looks good. It looks good. Uh, this side looks really good. Like I said, I had to get a little aggressive with this side because it was it was filthy. Wow, I don't know what it is lately with this that does just does not want to focus. Give me a second here. Okay, let's try that again. <laughs> I don't know why she doesn't want to focus lately. But it's getting on my nerves, like right now, like why won't it focus? But anyways, that looks good. That looks much, much, much better than what it did. And why won't it focus? Jeepers. Yeah, I don't know what the hell is going on with this thing lately. Something's going on here. Okay, that looks much better. Much, much better. Uh, we'll check the other side too, but that looks, that looks great. That side looks good, and so does this side here. Yep, that looks good too. Uh, shed a little light on it maybe. Yeah, that looks, that looks much, much, much better. I haven't done the CPU side yet though, but, um, yeah, that looks better. So I may test it with this first and then move into the actual CPU here because again like that for sure is nasty there and I'm sure there's some other spots here that are going to be nasty but it does to me it did look like if you look at these solder pads now it looks like they actually have solder on them that one is still a little rough. I'm not going to lie. That one right there is still a little rough. But I bet you if I check, I bet you I have good continuity. What the hell is that? Is that just crap? Yeah, I think that's just... Yeah, I think that's just, what do you call it? Flux. Yeah, it looks like it. Okay, yeah, that's just flux. Wasn't sure what that was at first, but yeah. Okay, that does look good. That looks much, much better than what it did. So let me get, uh, let me fire it up here and see what happens, and then uh, I'll report back. Whoops, 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 back up here. Okay, so everything checks out fine so far. That was wild. I don't know what the hell that was. Yeah, okay. Is it gonna fucking reset? Oh, what the hell? Yeah, something ain't right. Okay. Yep, it just it'll just keep resetting nonstop. So something has happened here. Now, the more I look in here, do you see that? 
So, how much you want to bet that now a trace has been severed under here? You see that corrosion under here? Right in here? Behind here? That's not good. That is not good. Yeah, I can almost guarantee that that's what's going on. And I did not see that prior to. How much you want to bet that there's shit in there? I might have to ask the client what he wants to do with this. I mean, a lot of stuff you see is not, it's not bridged or anything. It's just, just flux and stuff in there. See? Just flux. <sighs> yep. I wish I would have seen that ahead of time. But I didn't. Well, not until I cleaned it up anyways. Well, shit. Man, these boards are just so notorious for corrosion. They're so bad. You know, this is like a damned if you do, damned if you don't thing, right? If I didn't try to clean it up, it's just going to keep resetting anyways or, or halting on that and free locking up, right? And now that I've done it, now it's even worse. Because I don't really see any of that shit on this side. I mean, everything looks good. I mean, it looks way better than what it did, but now it's caused an issue. What the hell is that? Let me just check to see what the hell that is. What the fuck is that? What is that? Uh, excuse me. Let me get that down on the desk here. What the fuck was that? Where was that? It's right. Where the hell did I put that? Fuck, I can barely s I can't see what the hell that was. Whatever it was, was hard and chunky. I wonder if... It's probably nothing. But I wonder if it was something up underneath the chip. And I just pulled it out from, from cleaning. Let me see if I can find that. Give me a second here. Yeah, I hate to say it, but I think this is toast. I mean, I don't want to remove it yet. Only because I want to talk to the client, see what, see what he wants to say, or see what he's going to say. But, yeah, I got a feeling that this right here is, is the issue. It's not the CPU. I got a feeling it's this, this right here, this U14. Yep, I got a feeling that that is in, for sure the issue. I mean, there's definitely something wild going on here with it. So I guess we can put the green board up and see what happens. I mean, if we can get two out of or one out of the two working that's uh you know that's a bonus so okay let me uh put this one aside and we'll we'll try a green board uh oh this isn't good either you guys can probably already see it from there look at this Oh, that is not good. I, I can't even boot that. And look at this here. Oh, that's not good. Oh, that is definitely not good. Well, shit. Oh, man, oh, man, oh, man. Yeah, this is just not good. Not good at all. Whew. If I boot that, that's going to fry. 
or this too down here, the U14. That's, uh, well, shit. I mean, I can see this thing's been through hell and back. I mean, you can see connectors are broken off here. No modem. It's been, it's, well, shit. Oh, I hate when this happens. I really do. Because, I mean, you know, somebody goes out of their way and sends you stuff and this happens, right? Or what happens with the red board. So I, I emailed the customer about the red board and uh, the only thing I can think of is I can try to pull one of these off of one of the spare boards that I have, right? And see if I can't get that on here and or on the red one and see if that, but this, oh man, oh man, oh man. That is just, that's toast. Like, I can tell you right off the bat, these lines right here, these are what run to the hard drive right off the bat. These right here. These lines here, they all run up through here to here. These are all, they all run underneath here. I know they do because I have a board that I can show you that. That I mean, there's, wow. Yeah, we're in trouble here. Look at that. These pins will snap. These will snap right off. And it almost looks like somebody even attempted something on that even. Maybe not. Maybe it's just... I mean, that side looks okay besides that. I'm trying to justify... <laughs> trying to work. I can... Wow, shit. I mean, what's the harm in at least throw in a little isopropyl on it and see what happens but I think we all know what's going to happen when I do this yeah I almost think that it's almost time to give up on these boards I mean unless it's just a hard drive issue where I need somebody needs me to make them an image or something right I think it's almost time to give up on these boards and stop working on these because this is just this is what it's coming down to lately. These things have just been in storage for so long that, well, this shit is happening. Oh, man, oh, man. Yeah, now I feel real bad for him. You know, went out of his way to send all this stuff, and it's going to be nothing but bad news. Try to be really, really gentle here. This side over here doesn't look too, too bad. But this definitely looks like there was, well, mousies on it for sure. Now, I was hoping we were going to be able to get at least one out of the two up and running. And, you know, the red board is at least somewhat still in the game. Let's see how much shit we got off that. But I know for a fact that those are all, those are all, those are all touching. All that corrosion is touching for sure. Let me see how much of this I can get off and then. Jeepers. Yeah, well, I mean. Quite a bit of it did come off. I'm not gonna not gonna lie, I'll show you here. Maybe if I keep working this a little bit, maybe uh maybe he'll get lucky. Looks like a lot of it on this side came off too, but I can I can see the shit like on the top of the chip. You can see all like dirt and grit all on top, and that's probably well, it's probably most piss.
uh, just trying to pull off as much of this corrosion away as possible. Get some of this shit off the top here. And the thing is, finding these chips is, I mean, sure, you can find them, but you're way better off buying a new board. I mean, as expensive as they are, because they are super, super expensive. But buying, excuse me, buying the chips individually is more. Which is wild. Let's take a look at what we got going on here compared to what it was. I mean, at least now we can see what's happening here. And like I said, this came pretty clean back here. All right, but I'm definitely going to have to go through it. This side's not bad. That side's not bad. You know, it looks all... What the fuck? Is that just... The way it's sat. Sorry, where the hell am I here? It looked like it was way off, did it not? You don't want to focus down there, do you? Oh man, that that ain't fucking right. No, oh, you can't tell me somebody didn't attempt something on this. There's no fucking way. That's not the way it should be. No way in hell. Oh, look it, look it, look it, look it, look it, look it. I think somebody tried to put this... I, I think somebody tried to put a CPU on this. I thought that looked... funny. There's no way it came out of the factory like that. There's no way. I mean, that should be... Bang on. Yeah, there's no way it should be like that. Ah, oh, shit. All right, give me a second. Let me see what I'm going to do here. Okay, I put a video card in it after cleaning it up in the boot ROM. I can almost guarantee we're not going to get shit out of this. Not a damn thing. I bet you that light don't even... I bet you that doesn't even come on. Exactly. Though you can tell it's in full reset. Yeah, I can tell. Yep. So that's, I mean... Yeah. Oh, that is actually getting a little warm there. So that's... That might be running, but this isn't for sure. Yeah. I mean, even after cleaning it up, the only thing I can do is literally get in here and literally unsolder all this and put and you know same on this side these like i said these sides aren't bad same on this these sides aren't bad but this and this are bad um i'm still finding like little mouse pieces and stuff all around here so i know a mouse has been on this board for sure i'm almost wondering if this guy was told that you know oh they've been kept in storage well this and that and you know you know they're not i mean i can attempt this Fuck, but I don't know if I should. I really don't know. Um, fuck, why not, right? Let's see what happens. Let's see how much more I can clean this up. Because, I mean, it's, it's bad. It's bad, bad. Okay, so I talked to the client. And, uh, yeah, I'm going to try to replace this. I have a spare green board that should have the same chip and uh he already knows that yeah these this is worst case scenario for this you know but uh yeah we're gonna try to replace this so i'll remove this i'll remove the other one put the other one on here and uh we'll see what happens okay i just literally just got done removing it like it's still boiling hot here the chip uh yeah i can see the corrosion up under here yep how much you want to bet that that those were shorted? I can see the crap under here. 
I can probably see some more corrosion going on here as well. Uh, this board might be toast too. I mean, I wouldn't doubt that. Uh, let me see if I can get in a little closer here and then turn that on. Let's see if that makes a difference. Yeah, I don't doubt that those were shorted together. It's almost no doubt in my mind. Well, shit. So, I'm going to get this one cleaned up. I'm going to grab another one and get it on here and just see what happens. Okay, so I just cleaned up that little that little area there. You can still see the corrosion through those vias, right? And, yep, sure enough, well, after I clean that off, or just before I clean that off, this is where that spot of corrosion was. And, sure enough, that there and that there they were shorted together because this one runs to here to this via which is these two but all one two three four were shorted now if this and this isn't shorted so that probably took that chip out something internally probably went bad in that chip and me cleaning it up probably made it even worse <laughs> that's you know like i said i'm i might almost be done trying to fix these boards only because of it's you know this right and I can I smelt the mouse piss when I was heating it up. It's oh, that's not a fun smell. But now it's okay. Um, there is still that spot concerns me a little bit right here. That concerns me. I don't know where that goes. That's probably they're probably tied together right there to that via. It looks like it, but I mean, look how bad these are. I mean, it was there's corrosion underneath all these vias pretty much and i mean i don't know where else but a lot of them do have corrosion in them like they pretty much all do <sighs> that's just not good just not good okay and sure enough great whoops where's my other probe here um right here i'm gonna try to do this so you can see this via right here is supposed to be these two okay that line's there okay that line oh see and this line here the more i scrape away the better it gets but i don't know if you've got a break because there's a trace here and a trace here and then a trace that runs like this this trace right here oh, see there's so much corrosion going I mean I guess it's here around the ring so I guess it is connected but that come on yeah see these are just these are bad these are just bad and look at this one here I can definitely see the pad the trace to right here I can't get shit out of it nothing oh, there, oh. see around the edge maybe yeah oh man well okay I'll just do what I said and then I'm gonna clean this up and then we'll go from there ah that bums me out Alrighty, we got the uh, we got the new one on here. Now this one is everything's the same, right? But I didn't notice that this is 0016 uh, WX002, and the original one is 25. I don't know if that makes a difference. I couldn't find everything else. I couldn't find any information on that. I could, this here, this um, number here on the top, and the number here is all the same. Even the Rev One and everything. But I'm not going to lie, this has got me a little freaked out because I don't know if it's the same. I don't even know if it's going to boot here. Um, uh, what do I need here? I got power. I'm not going to put the drive in yet because I just want to see if it boots or even starts to boot. Uh, oh, i got to turn that on. Hang on. Whoops. Shit. Pfft. Whoops. Hang on here. Hang on here. What do I got going on? Sorry. Okay, let's uh, let's do this together. Are we gonna get the magic smoke or are we gonna get a boot here? I have no idea. 
Oops. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. Okay. So at least we're back up. There's the original there, by the way. And I'll show you. That says W25. Okay, so that's working. Are we getting stupid hot here or anything? Doesn't seem like it. Okay, hang on. Let's, uh... Let me get you sat down here. Let's get a drive. Let's see. If it's the same thing, then... I mean, it's got to be the CPU, too, I guess. But I had a feeling that it was this chip down here, but maybe not. I don't know. Now I'm second-guessing myself. I'm going to put it in this one just to, you know, have some kind of control. Like, we know that was that. So, uh, let's try this again. Okay, we got hard drive activity. That's good. Okay, let's see what happens here. Let's see if we get a reset. Oh, no way. Oh, oh we might be back in business here. No way. I'm not going to lie, that is getting a little warm. It's your game. Uh, let's see, can we get past the goofiness here? Oh, here we go. Boom. No way. Yep, see, so that was... That was the issue. That was the issue. No fucking way. Sorry for the language, but there it is. There's the original one. That's the, oh, see it says 2.5 here. I didn't know if that was gonna be a difference or not, but. That is getting warm in the center. I don't know if that's normal or what, or how normal that is. But there we go, that's up and running. No effing way. I had a feeling it was that chip, and I was right. No way. All right, let me shut it down here. Um, fucking no way. Right on. Um, oh, this is excellent. This is excellent, especially for the customer. You know what I mean? Because, you know, you've already got to pay for the bench fee and, you know, the attempt and stuff like that. But I'd rather make the money on fixing it, and I'm sure he would rather have it fixed and have two bum boards. Right? So, okay, this is this is huge. Now, I'm obviously going to let, let this board play for a bit. And I won't put you through that. Um, as for the other board, the green board, his green board, uh, I don't know what we're going to do with that. Um, but yeah, obviously, so that was the issue. I thought there was something goofy with this. There's no way it would reset, reset, reset. I mean, usually when the CPU goes... That light does not flash. Sometimes it does. It depends on what part of the CPU is dead, right? But more than likely, if that's blinking, that this is okay, right? But the fact that it kept locking up and freezing, especially in different spots, especially after I reflowed the original one, and then it would just keep resetting, resetting, resetting. And like I said, I've got no voltage control over this. So whatever this is giving, this is getting, right? So it's not like I bumped the voltage up and now that's why it's working. You know what I mean? No, it's getting what it's <laughs> what this is giving it. And the voltage was okay. And as soon as I switched this out, sure enough. Sure enough. And you know how ridiculously difficult it is to do these quad flat packs. But yeah, everything looks good. Everything looks good. So yeah, I bet you that what I showed you here was shorted right in here and that was the issue with this i don't know if this is still good or not but i bet it's not i bet it's not because it just got me thinking like was it because it's short it was shorted here was it a line that was shorted and not the actual internals but no here we go we're up and running uh let me contact the customer here okay so i guess the only thing to do left is to put his video card in because that's one that i pulled off of mine so let me uh, shut this down. 
me shut that down and let me grab uh, let me grab his video card and make sure that's okay. Okay, so it's been running right now. So I'm gonna shut this down and I'm gonna put his video card in here. And I kind of got interrupted while filming. But uh, yeah, so here's my spare card. And you can see like it's it's filthy. Like my card is absolutely filthy. Now I'm gonna grab his card and guess what? It's gonna lock up and freeze. Watch this. His video card in and turn it on and watch it'll freeze it'll lock up okay, oops let me back you out here sorry yep so we had multiple problems here at first it was running fine it was running fine watch it'll lock up Now I tried my video card in it and it was locking up. So I know that the, uh, the U14 chip was bad too, but if his video card is bad, that's gonna kill him. Cause not only does he have to now pay for that, now he's got to buy a video card. Oh, that's gonna kill him. That's gonna, it's, it's gonna cost a fortune. Watch, it'll lock up. See, no scoreboard. That should have already came up. The scoreboard should have already came up. Now, I'm not going to stop the video. Watch. Should I wait for it to reset? Because it's going to. Zero hard drive activity. Uh, uh, activity. Watch. It's going to lock up. I know it's going to. Oh, that's, this is not good for him. Not good at all. Oh, I just seen a, a blip. Oh, but that's why. Boom. Restart. Now watch this. I'm going to remove his card. So his card removed. And I can tell you. There might be a little, something a little funky going on on this RAM chip right here. I wonder if that's what's going on. But that gets awfully hot. Like, I mean stupid hot already. I know these cards run hot, but my card doesn't. So I'm going to grab my card again. Whoops. The screws were stopping me there for a second. So my card in. Now watch this. I bet you when it gets to that blue, whatever it is, blue ridge or whatever that course is, I bet you the scoreboard comes up in like three seconds. Maybe I might have to do some work to that video card as well. And that's like, I can't sell him my card because I need a good card, right? For this reason alone. Or any arcade machine that takes this. Now watch, bet you it comes up. Boom. What'd I tell you? So his card's bad too? Come on. Oh, Lord. This is what I'm talking about being done fixing these things. They're just so tore up. Okay. Uh, let me stop in here and let me take a look at this video card and see what's going on. Okay, so I'm investigating this card here. And I do see some, some shit. I don't know what that is. Right? I don't know if that's rust or what. But as I'm doing my inspection, I haven't even gotten through and, like, tried to... Where's my, uh... Oh, I don't even care. Wait a second. I was going through, or I'm going to go through and make sure all these are still attached and everything. Right, make sure we don't have any loose ones or whatever. So I'm going through and I'm just giving it a quick visual inspection. I see that, right? And uh, 
I see that this one is upside down. Well, this one's upside down compared to. So I check and I think that's appropriate. So I get over here and I notice the same thing here. And then I notice this. Well, that ain't on anymore. I wonder... <laughs> I'm going to have to go back to my original theory and say that somebody cobbled together this machine. That's what I'm thinking happened is, and some is, oh, it works, you know what I mean? Like, no, 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 it don't. Because the way this guy had these wrapped up, there's no way that happened in shipping. That bin like that, that something has been dropped on that card. Now, I don't know if that's going to repair it or not. I mean, that could be, that chip could be toast for all i know but i tell you what i am going to do is i'm going to go through and i'm going to check all these pins on all this on these rams here right i don't know if i even have a replacement if that's bad i don't want to pull any off of the card i have because i need it but i'm gonna let's see let's do this together just for shits and giggles sake right let's just see if these two well so if it's this corner here it would be this corner over here on this chip here let me zoom you out here real quick. I just want to see if those two are shorted together on the board, like supposed to be like that. I highly doubt it, but... So that's the first pin. And that's the second pin. No. So let's check to see if these are shorted on this side. Uh, that I mean, just from the visual eye, that looks like it's just a mangled mess of shit. I get in here a little closer. It does look like they are shorted together. I mean, it's not touching, that's for sure, but. Okay, it doesn't look like they're shorted, but that pin is definitely off. Let me see if I can get in here and repair that and then give this a shot. Oh, this is getting bad. <laughs> Okay, so this is literally the best I can do to get them unseparated. Sorry, let me see if I can get you a little closer here. Probably not because everything's in the way and I don't even know where I am here. Sorry. That is literally the best I can do to get them. I mean, they're ready to snap. I mean, that first pin is so and was so mangled. But they are not shorted together. Nothing is shorted anymore. Nothing is loose. That first pin is on. Everything is good. Even though those uh, pin two and three look close, they're not. They're not soldered together. They're not. They're not joined. Everything is, you know, as it should be. So we might as well, might as well fire it up. I called the client, let him know what was going on. Sorry, I'm trying to zoom out here. This is a junk video. Okay. So I got everything set up again. I just want to show you his card here. This is literally the best I could do. I mean, these pins were ready to snap right off because they're so fragile, but they are separated. They are soldered. That first pin is soldered back on and it was actually two and three were actually soldered. I mean, um, uh, smashed together because it wasn't exactly showing on this, but when I went to another Ram slot and checked, yeah, sure enough, they were. They were, so that is literally the best I can do without, you know, damaging them any more than what they are. So let's do, let's do a test. Might as well do it together. Let me see if I can't get you a little more, uh, shoot it upwards like that. Oh, I hope this works for him because you guys know how expensive these cards are. I would hate for it to be the GPU itself, but I think we got it here because that first pin wasn't attached and those two were they were joined so uh, let's see what happens well so far so good mm, why are we not getting uh why are we flashing in and out here well, give me a second here what is happening here do I not have that fucking card in right? Let's move it out. Let's 
get it back in here. I don't know if I had that in properly or not. So all this, all that's okay, all that's okay. Let's try this again, sorry. There, I don't think I had it in all the way. Whoops. Shit happens. There's no, there's no screws on it or anything holding it down, so he's gonna need a set of that too. Come on, please, please just show. I hope that was it for him. We just want to see that leaderboard show up and we want to see it get into game. Come on. Come on, come on, yes! Yes, that's what we want, there it is. Holy shit. Yes, amazing. Wow. Wow, okay, good, he's gonna be happy. That's what it was, I mean, that's, this is why you gotta do a good visual inspection, right? Cause I missed that. I didn't see that on the video card. I didn't expect that. Did not expect that at all. Oh, that is amazing. Okay, so, okay, well, perfect. I think, uh, I think the game plan now is to uh, get this back to him. And uh, I'm gonna tell him that he should uh, definitely get a uh, fan for the GPU. Cause you know how hot these run, right? Okay, so I think that's gonna, uh, I think that's gonna do it for this one. I don't know what we're gonna do with the green board yet. Maybe a video, maybe second video, I don't know. We'll see, but uh, yeah. All right, if you guys enjoyed this, you know what to do. Like, comment, subscribe, all that fun stuff, and uh, I'll see you in the next one.